through weather and take you outside tonight on this Saturday night. This is a live look over Rancho Cordova. A few cars on the road at this time. We want to bring in meteorologist Dirk Fedor and Dirk. I know that we're seeing some funnel clouds, some rain. Chain controls even up for folks going in and out of the Sierra tonight? Yeah, over I 80, we do have chain controls that okay. are currently up from Kingvale to Donner Lake. And wow. uh, so, yeah, and that's, <laughs> there is some ice on the road. We have had some snow. Snow, though, starting to taper off a bit, and the rain is pretty much moved on. We do have a few areas of rain still to talk about, but right now we have 54 degrees in Sacramento, 55 Stockton, as well as Modesto at 55, and Lake Tahoe sitting above freezing at 36 degrees. Winds, uh, again, a little bit of a breeze making its way through Fairfield from the southwest at 14 miles per hour. We have a wind of 12 miles per hour in Sacramento and a 12 mile an hour breeze currently at Lake Tahoe. This is a time lapse from earlier today showing the dark clouds. These were thunderstorms that were developing just to the north of uh, Sacramento and then rolling on towards the Lincoln, well, between Lincoln and Roseville is where we saw most of that activity and that started to taper off as the sun made its way lower in the horizon over the west. And here we are looking off to the east at those showers as they push their way up the west slope of the Sierra. Satellite view showing us again still some cloud cover out there, but we should see a decrease in cloud cover as we head into tomorrow. We're going to catch a bit of a break from this weather that we've been dealing with today. We can see shower activity in the Sierra will be decreasing as we head into Sunday morning. We should see some sunshine for your Sunday morning and through the afternoon. Again, a mix of high clouds will be blown on by, but other than that, we are looking at conditions that should be slightly warmer tomorrow than they were today. Today we were in the upper 60s. Tomorrow we should make our way up to around 70 degrees in most spots. Then we get into Monday and another weather system rolls through, and this is going to bring the chance for a few more showers. Most of the showers will be along the I-80 corridor and points north. Uh, better chance in the mountains, of course, than the valley. We'll see that uh, push through on Monday and then it clears out and then another little wave comes in on Tuesday and that's going to keep our temperatures in the upper 60s to around 70 degrees with a chance for some showers mainly along the coastal mountains and in the Sierra. Very limited, though, amount of moisture associated with those waves. Valley Planner showing us that tomorrow we will have some sunshine in the valley with temperatures eventually warming into the upper 60s to around 70 degrees. We're forecasting a daytime high in Sacramento of 70 degrees, and that should be reached between 4 and 5 o'clock in the afternoon. Foothill Planner temperatures pushing into the 60s with mostly sunny skies, winds anywhere from 5 to 10 miles per hour, and the Sierra also catching a break from any rain or snow. We will see a few clouds here and there, but temperatures eventually warming into the mid to upper 40s for daytime highs and we will see conditions again changing with more showers in the forecast on Monday and then again on Tuesday, but there's some drier weather ahead with warmer temperatures. In fact, we could be seeing temperatures in the 80s and even into the 90s as we head towards next weekend. We'll take a closer look at that coming up now back over.